Hey, 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 everybody. We're back. Coon Prairie Ramblers. And Fat Welcome Albert. Welcome back. With the KC and the Moonshine Gang. And Fat Albert. Where's your Moonshine <laughs> Gang? Fat Albert over there? Yep. Uh, mm-hmm. And we got the, uh, the Emmy Bill Affable Mel Band and uh, y- uh, Yeti. Yeti. The last behind the glass. And special and guest. The Lexophile. T Lex. <laughs> that sounds like you could be arrested for being an Lexophile. Uh, I know it. You hear about him, you hear about her, she's a Lexophile. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that, she they, was they, called they red handed. They got her over jail yeah. there, but they can't figure out they can't find the right code in the book. They can't break the code. They don't know what to what she's been arrested well, for. Lexophile. Where's that at? They in knew here? it can't be good. That's gotta go, be good for two years. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah I bet you if they got a lexicon. Yeah. They can lexicon, figure it out. There you go. Well there's plenty of cons in there. Some of them are bound to be oh, lexicons. Yeah. Right, they can figure it out. Yeah, something like <laughs> that. Anyhow, that's almost hypnotic. Yeah, there's a segue for you. <laughs> oh, what are we going to talk about in our next segment? Yeah, oh, what about hypnotism? Yeah. Hypnotism. There's one good idea. Uh-oh. Whose time has come? And this was <laughs> this the variety. idea by the semi-world famous Mel Jackson. He's famous in Ohio, yeah. Florida, and parts of Cambodia. That's right. Well, I was asking if you'd ever, if anybody had ever been hypnotized and i, think, I have and do you think you could hypnotize i have somebody? never been hypnotized by another person yeah you hypnotized by yourself i've right. hypnotized myself yeah. what yeah how how you do that it's easy you, you don't, don't do it on purpose no it ain't nothing <laughs> like that you've probably been hypnotized yeah well i do it yeah hey uh, uh, a lot of people like, don't realize that and you can also, i can daydream a lot is that kind of like you being can hypnotized? hypnotize yourself Trying to go to sleep at night if you know what you're doing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but who's going to bring you out of it? You don't. Know, next morning you wake up and you're out of well, it. Your wife on you. Get it, it's not, it, well, hypnotism is not necessarily everything that are not just limited to what people think of people performing on stage being right. stupid. Right. Is it real? Yeah. Is it real? Well, I think a lot of that stuff on stage is people wanting to be. Hey, did you hear? You know, you, you got to believe it. I think before did you hear it Jack's story. Yeah, yeah. I've seen some and videos. His wife. They went to Asani's. Yeah. Yep. And and they both did not believe. They were non-believers. So she got up there and she was going to go through it. Make my day. Yeah. And she got hit. And he whipped out that little watch on the on the fob and the, the, the Jack, chain. He witnessed the whole thing. <clears throat> his wife was up there. She's doing all kinds of super stuff, which isn't her. You know, isn't her? I wouldn't like that. Yeah, no, I wouldn't. No, do I don't. Yeah. yeah. No tell him what you're going to do. Then but I have too many secrets. He did say. He did. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, we'll talk later. I have heard that uh, they will kind of get a group and then they'll pick a few that they just kick out. I think know that they don't think they'll be able to hypnotize them. Right. Now you go have a seat. You go have a seat. Then they tell them get them to do a group activity. Yeah. You're all in a life, but you're in a rowboat, and then you're going over the falls here. You got to paddle this way, and they're and they're all. Yeah. Acting like they're paddling a boat or something. Let me ask you this question. Have you ask ever been away. driving a car? Yeah. Oh, yeah. On a, like a very mundane yeah. highway. On uh-huh. a dark desert highway. And you're just driving, clicking, counting posts, and you're going along. Yeah. And you're doing this for a mile. And all of a sudden, you wonder, did I go through what you or yet? Or yeah. have I already passed? Where am I? Or I have am. I passed DCI yet? Or I something no like that. And you I'm don't at. know. Yeah. That's a form of uh, hypnotism. road hypnotism. Yeah. But, if but if your wife was sitting next to you and she says, act like a chicken. No, you don't do it that way. Oh. Turn loose of the wheel. <laughs> you turn loose of the wheel, start flopping it, all it's around. It's not that stage <laughs> yeah. hypnotism. And the other thing is, have you ever been watching a movie or reading a book and you get so totally immersed in that? Yeah. As you have somebody talking to you, calling your name, yeah. Mel. Yeah. Mel. Mel. I'm doing that to my wife, Carrie. And, Carrie, Carrie. and you don't respond. Yeah. Because you're so... That's that's a form of hypnotism. Yeah. Yeah, hypno, form of hypnosis. Next time I see you, like, I'm going to say, act like a chicken. Act like a chicken. And, and you don't necessarily do it on purpose, but you almost go into an altered state. Yeah. And well, you can do that uh, trying to go to sleep at night, too. Is hypnotism the same as a trance? Uh, mm. I don't know what a trance is. But I had surveying you. Well, like when I when I when you're talking about getting really into a book, I'll really get into a book, and it'll be like describing a winter scene. And even though it's right. the middle of summer outside, I'll expect to look up and see snow out my window because exactly. I'm so into the book. 
So is that a hypnotic state or is it a trance or is it just it's a good hypnotic, writing? It's a hypnotic state. <laughs> the power I, of I think the good writing takes you there. But, um, it should. Yeah. If not, it's not a good book. Yeah. When, I, when I read books, I know exactly what the characters look like. Yeah. I know how they act. I, I know, you know, if I met them in person, I would say, oh, that's, you know, so-and-so. But uh, it's wondering, I hate to watch a movie after reading a book. Right. Because I'm looking at the actor saying, no, that's not Jack Reacher. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if it's Tom, Tom Cruise. Yeah. Huh. Little, yeah, you got a five-foot five okay. guy playing a six-foot okay, five so guy. Hypnotism, like to quit smoking. Does that really work? Yeah, for some well, people, I, I I've think. never done it, but never yeah, smoked. Some been people hypnotized. do. Hypnotism to start smoking. You yeah, have I think this, you could just do you that. Have just this liar. <laughs> to That'd smoke be weird. If you hypnotize people and have them start smoking, they can do it. I think to uh, not eat so much too. Oh, oh yeah. Well, you can hypnotize a chicken. Yeah, act you, like can, a, you can do it to a cat. Did you tell them to act like a coyote? We used to. We he goes used, on the tax the rest of the chickens. We used to uh, when we were working cows and all. We'd take a calf and you'd have him down laying on his side, and yeah. you take your hat off and put it over his head where he can't see, yep. and you start rubbing his belly for a minute. Yeah, and then you just stand up and leave your hat on there, and he just he won't move. It. He'll lay there. Wow. He'll not move. Uh, that's right. Now, unless something all of a sudden startles him. Yeah. But he'll just lay there. Then he'll jump off and take <laughs> off with your hat. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it doesn't fit him, so he falls oh. off. <laughs> But would know. you do it? Would you be hit? No, I would you go? I, with? I don't want to be. I don't want to be out of control. That's paranoia. I don't. Yeah. I don't think I would allow myself to. Yeah. No. Unless there's somebody was so good they could just walk by and go. Boom. I don't want. That's right. Then they got you. Make me do something stupid. Oh, yeah. I do enough stupid. I do. Things. That's exactly right. So I'm here. Huh. Well, I, I can't, and I'm not going to try it to prove a point. But I don't think I could get up in front of a bunch of people. And be as stupid as some of those people are being. Jack says you could. If they, they say you the right person. I don't think I could. Oh. Because I don't think I would allow myself, yeah. right. number one, to be under the influence of another person's okay. suggestion. Then in well, that heard, case, they would kick you out of the. Well, I've heard that you won't do anything uh, you know, morally wrong that you wouldn't do anyway. Like You that, wouldn't moon you, the crowd or you're something. Up there, yeah, turn around and moon the crowd. I mean, you know better. Of course, some people delight in that, so they'd be glad to, to drop trial. We, we know somebody would drop. Bend over, crack them a smile. Yeah, there's people who do that, but. We but do. Uh, normally, <laughs> who are you looking at? Yeah, <laughs> you'll never thinking, know. I was, thinking, I was thinking about a crab eater. Oh, okay. Oh, a yeah. Twenty-six plate crab. Twenty-six plate crab eater. We know who that is. Thanks for that visual, by the way. Yeah. So you don't think that you would even allow? Like, okay, say we're not at uh, Vasani's. Hey, Vasani's. I'm not, not going to allow my. Something. We're at this radio station. And there's just us here. Uh oh. And we have a guest hypnotist in it. We find <gasps> out all of a sudden Lex can hypnotize people. Uh oh. And she hypnotizes you. You're getting very sleepy. Would you do it? <laughs> Look into my eyes. Would you do it? No. <laughs> I don't want to do it. And we we promised we wouldn't record it on our phone. He's afraid you wake up naked. So hey, <laughs> what, that's the, that's the, what if controls. This anomaly, I don't come out of my trance. Oh, what happens if point. I can't come back? Well, then they, they put you in a home. They put you in a home then. Oh, yeah. Or your wife uses you for a doorstop. They or start something. giving me psychotropic medications. Yeah, smack you around. Shock hmm. therapy. Then what was his problem? I well, went to the hypnotist and the Bassanis. <laughs> <laughs> it might be fun to be able to hypnotize people, though, and turn them into something and watch them for a while. Like, say, a chicken, or you're an opera singer, or you're a ballet dancer, or something other. It'd be hilarious. Or you're a now, superhero. Now, if you could. Improve somebody's voice. I don't think you could do that. I don't uh, think that so would either. be nice. Yeah. yeah, you could hypnotize them. Okay, yeah. you'll be able to hit a high C over yeah. a C. The vocalize it's, it's say, right oh, there oh. in the mask. It wouldn't oh, work, yeah. but I think they would try really hard. I'll have a five octave range. Oh boy, yeah. <laughs> like uh, what's her face, uh, Roy Orbison. What if you could though? Like, what if you were in such a relaxed state that your body could do things that you couldn't do when you're in control of all of your your faculties? Oh, yeah. yeah, that would be good. Yeah. And we might have to come back and visit this. We're down to about 15 seconds yeah. now, so we might come back and talk about this more or move on to something else. But it's been hypnotic, y'all. Y'all sit tight. I hope y'all aren't in a trance. We'll be back.